Welcome back to Draymond Does Gaming. Draymond here playing more Baldur's Gate 3 and just taking a look at the map here because last time uh, we finished off the Harpies over here. Got Karlak, kind of did this section. Um, now it's a matter of what do we, where do we go from here? Did we do that last time? Harpies and Karlak. Oh, we did Harpies and Karlak. Then we... Then we did this whole section, came up here, did a whole bunch, right, I'm thinking two two times ago. Um, either way, we have Carlac, <laughs> and that's what matters. Carlac's great. Uh, okay, that's, that's all we need to know about that. I want to go check out this cave, I think that was the, the next part of our plans, right? Um, oh, can we, like, jump up here, actually, instead? And go up over here? Oh, yeah, so this cave kind of goes up that way. Got it. So we can actually just come up this way, rather than go in the cave. Um, I mean, both of the things are probably good for us to do. Um, and from what I remember, there were like knolls up here, so we are all going to sneakity sneak. Oh yeah. Knoll hunters, lots of knolls. And then we're going to enter turn-based mode. Oh, that's Rugen. Okay, so that's the guy that we heard about. Um, so this would not be a bad idea then to have Karlak just like destroy this person. They rolled a 13. Uh, we'll use the 15. Hear that? Someone's fighting the gnolls. We should help. Don't be a fool, lad. Shut your mouth and keep your head down. Leave the heroics to them that don't value their own skin. What a jerk. Okay. Um... Well, this guy's almost dead. We could frenzy then. Everyone's surprised, which is good for us. Any other knolls like up here? No? Okay, because we can come up here. Burning hands is just for that. We could grease them all down here. There's a cat. Oh, nice. Into explosions. That's pretty good. Who's this guy? Flind. That's a Knoll Warlord. Got it. Karlac. You are up, my dear. Let's cleave. And we'll reckless attack. Nice. And then we can frenzy this guy. Frenzied strain. What does that do? Adds a penalty to attack rolls every time stacking, so you miss more often. This adds until the end of your frenzy. But we do extra damage. Got it. Okay. Cat. I'm kind of in the middle of doing something here. Here. You want to play? The joys of a kitten, right? Uh, 
At least these guys are taking some damage, burning, etc. Acid. Rude. And if they want to come up here, they've got quite a lot of stuff. Um, perhaps taking bonus actions or reactions. We kind of want Karlak to be able to take bonus actions, because that's her frenzied strike. Um, that's, that's okay, maybe we can just break his concentration instead. Ow. Rude. Okay. Gale is up. We're all in here, right? How come I didn't get a chance to go? Like, what the heck? I mean, this would hit both of them. And I have a feeling that that would be a good thing. So let's do that. Nice. I guess that's it there. Flail of pain. Well, they're not wrong. That was a flail, and it was of pain. Okay. High defense. Yeah, we just have to go for the destroy. Yeah, let's reckless attack. There you go. Nice. Hyenas. Like, how come we didn't get a chance to like go here like what the heck hi cat hmm well either way we'll we'll figure it out i guess um yeah we'll use cutting words cuz why not <laughs> fantastic but please do not kill Gale. Not cool. Okay. Well, one healing word. Two. Cat. <laughs> I don't know what you want. 35, 55, 55, 55. Dissonant Whispers. It has a chance to kill this guy. And that could be good. Um, it could also Bane. Yeah, let's do that. Nice. And kind of just get out of the acid over there. Wish you guys would actually be coming here to help me. Oh, come on. You guys are just really trying to kill Gale, eh? Get off my leg. Item received. Gale's pouch. Okay, well, Gale is dead. Got it. Really? Cat, this is not a... Ow! <sighs> not a good time, Cat. Not a good time. Alright. Uh, what in the heck do we do here? Revify Gale, like down here. He's too far away. Okay, got it. Uh, well, this is rough. What in the heck do we do here? Okay. Um, I 
I mean, this... I'm, I'm less concerned about that guy. If he hits me, he hits me. I think we just try and get him here. Heal. Oh, come on. How are you guys not getting attacked here? What is this nonsense? You're no longer whatevered. Maybe you can outright kill this one. It would be lovely. Okay. Nice. Frenzied strike. Reckless attack. That missed. That's unfortunate. The bites on Shadowheart or whatever. Okay, so this is a rough fight. Please stop hitting Gale. He has one health now. Please stop hitting me too. What is this? Okay. First off... Let's do this. Because that should bring up everybody. Secondly... Let's do... This. That sounds good. Then we have... We could put to sleep these two guys in the back, which wouldn't be a bad thing. Yeah. 32 would be these two. Big guy's up first, which I do not like. So how about we magic missile? Hopefully kill that one. And that one? Well, one's dead and he's super close to death. Have a potion. Maybe you'll be alive for a turn. Multi-attack. Um. Yeah, let's let's use that. We saved it. <laughs> well, he's just dead again. <laughs> uh, wow, that was rough. Okay. We reckless attack, because we're, we're just going to need to do that. This guy hasn't gone yet. Nice, he's so close to death. Frenzied strike. Man, it would be nice if he was dead. Man, it'd be nice if anything was dead. <laughs> Do I have an AoE attack? Isn't it my turn? Excuse me? <laughs> now it's my turn. Okay, got it. Um, oil of accuracy... 
Do I have like a alchemist fire? I don't have an action. Well, that's not good. I could drink a potion of speed to get an action to throw a alchemist fire at those three guys. I think that's worth it. It's very worth it. Get the hell up there. <laughs> okay. We no longer have our scroll of Revify. And that's okay. Do we need to heal anybody? Not really. So let's come down here and critically miss that hyena. That's so terrible. Can you stop? I thought he was dead already. Hell, oh, necrotic energy, aura. Oh, I guess he was just downed before. But now he's dead. All right, got it. Okay. Yeah, come on up here. You're fine. Um, vicious mockery. Yeah. He saved. How come Carlac didn't get a go? I swear. Um, yeah, we'll use cutting words, because we can. Heal you. And just come up in here and try to strike this guy. Even with true strike, eh? Like, what is this nonsense? Okay. Reckless attack. Murder this guy. One health left. Well, with only two hyenas left. Wow. Okay. Get you up. Hmm? How come I can do it again? Oh, because I have the potion of speed, that's right. Well, he saved. It's fine. Um, heal yourself is what you should do. Well, just hit that one then. He's almost dead. And that one has a vicious mockery, so he'll take a disadvantage. No longer um, anything, that's okay. Just hit him. Ow. That's how this fight went for me. It went, ow. Come on. Come on. There we go. Well, we are inspired. Something good here. I hope. By the gods, you're a sweet sight. Are any of my crew still alive out there? Um, let's see. No. This whole journey's been one grim sight after another. Gnolls, goblins, drow. 
Risen Road's more dangerous than ever. You're the first friendly face we've seen since Eltergard. Okay. Um, Eltergard's a long way from here. Where are you heading? Bound for Baldur's Gate. Got some cargo to deliver. But we've a stop to make along the way. Where's that? Joaquin's Rest. It's just up the road. I'd be enjoying a mug of ale right now if those beasts hadn't jumped us. Listen, you look like you know how to handle yourself. You should meet my associates. We've got our own drinking spot by the tavern. Invitation only. Okay. Tell the fellow on the door. Little serpent, long shadow. He'll take good care of you. Interesting. What's in the chest? Your cargo. Oh, the whole reason we're in this mess. Trinkets for some rich tosser in Baldur's Gate. He gets his shiny baubles. We get a handful of Terenths. Terenths are the currency of a merchant network called the Centerenth. Led by the mysterious Peragost of Darkhold, their dealings are far from scrupulous. Mm hmm. Darkhold was getting concerned. I've been sent to retrieve the shipment. Interesting. We could do that. You're familiar with the Zentarum. We have uh, a bonus advantage. And we get double 18s. Very nice. Let's do that. Let's take the cargo. Zaris won't be happy. But I suppose she can take it up with the Pergost herself. Take the chest. Interesting. If you haven't stopped by our Joaquin's rest spot, you should. I'm sure Zaris had welcomed such a prestigious guest. Zaris won't be happy. Oh. But if you haven't stopped by our Okay, that was weird. He doubled that up. Okay. Well let's first off get everything. Ooh. Shattered Flail. Hitting an enemy with this weapon heals the wielder for 1 to 6 points, but they go mad if they don't continue hitting an enemy each turn. And a mine... Oh, he had a mine player in him. I'll take that. Okay, we'll come down here because I think there was... Yeah. Some stuff right here that I wanted to grab. Okay. Oh, right there. Who knows? Speedy reply. Interesting. When you hit an enemy with this weapon, they gain momentum for two turns. I don't know, and I can't actually click on it either. So. I should speak up. Remember, getting that chest to Baldur's Gate is your job. Then we share the profits. Yes, yes. Oh, I wanted to see if you wanted to trade anything. Okay, one wolf hunter here that we... Or, er, wolf hunter. Knoll hunter. Okay. I'll come back down. Come on. Please don't step in the fire. I'll be glad when we're out of this bloody cave. Yep. Hundred and ten percent. I guess we pick it up. Done. They have a lot of alchemist fire here. Crates, sacks, sandals, wine, 
Rotten food. Perfect. So much good stuff. Traps, please. Oh, I think we're encumbered. <laughs> okay, so this I'm a, I'm assuming yeah, that weighs like a billion D pounds. There we go. An open hearsay. If you recognize Shar as goddess of creation or Selune is a goddess of destruction, yet both are true. Okay, so this is just some lore. Okay, we'll pick it up. Nice. Potions of healings. There we go, we can see a little bit now. Bucket. Open crates. Um, anybody else wanna? Nope, okay. How about we... Now oh, we all failed. Okay. Well, there's something up here that we want to see. And actually having like Carlac here. It doesn't look like we can get across at all, so. Can we lockpick this with her? She has guy. Oh, it's only a five. Nice. Okay. Cool. Nothing else really over here. Got it. So there's something down here. I'm assuming it's probably like a trap. Um, I like to short rest. Time to get going. And then I'd also like to go get like a Starion briefly. Steady. All right, we're supposed to go back to camp. My bad. Um, there he is. Take you instead of Carlac here just for a minute. Yes. Well, obviously I would, but excellent. Okay. So, do you have loves waiting for you once this is all over? You know what? Not the easiest of questions to answer. My eyes are just waiting, like a lovesick puppy. Short term amusements are much less hassle. Oh dear. Yeah. Someone's left a trap out there. I mean, you can't reach. Please don't step on the freaking mine, people. Why would you jump there? <laughs> okay. At least he can lockpick all this stuff easily. Okay, so that was, you know, one of the tougher fights that we've had so far. Nice. Traveling with company. If All right. Still alive. So that's progress. Not exactly what I wanted to do there. Relap sack. Okay. Everybody else can.
Okay. Oh, these guys left? They have left. Nice. Oh, we're encumbered now, so let's pass like all this stuff will add to where's What's that? It's just a cup. Add to wares. There we go. Perfect. Give it all to Shadowheart. She can sell stuff for us at some point in time. Um, also, if we go to our camping supplies, send to camp, yeah, that dropped us like 20, 20 pounds, which is fantastical. Ah, oops. Don't press that button. Oh, well, we can come up here. Campfire. Help see what else is up in in this area. Milk cans, bed rolls, wicker basket. Some more rotten food. Not exactly fun stuff. Oh, there's a sack here. With some rags. Ooh, arrows of darkness. Lots and lots of wine. Okay, so this cave just brings us back down. Okay, so we'll do that. Looks like we've gotten everything up here. Backpack over there. shoot the fire wine barrel. Just wanted to look at it. Crates. That's not what I wanted to do, but okay. That's a big ass boulder. Ah! Son of a gun. There we go. Um, that sucked. I am enjoying our walks together. <laughs> sure. In silence. Okay. Well, we can't go back that way now. <laughs> uh, ow. Let's let's put it that way. I think we do our other long or our other short rest here. Yeah, there we go. Um, let's go here. Do we care about having Carlac with us right now? Instead of Astarian. Um, what did we pick up as well? Shoot, that's what I wanted to look at. Thought we got. Oh, we did. Was it a starian that got these? Yeah. Reasons grasp. Whenever the wearer chooses to end their rage, they get 15 temp hit, hit points. Okay. So that's great for Garlac. No one stopped and that's about it. How much further can I go? So that's not too bad. We'll come up here. 
Um, and then I guess we come over here to this village. Oh, there's a accentuated boar. Intriguing. Doesn't that mean it's like loss of blood? Okay, we've searched that guy. Dagger root. Oh, and this is just up to here. Okay. That's why we like to come check. Yeah, because that's it from here. You want to come back down here. Um, maybe we should switch out some people briefly. Get Carlac and Will, maybe. Actually, yeah, you come here. Because we can. And then. That was really starting to hurt. Why are we slowing down? Oh. What does the infernal engine do to you? Power. But you've seen it in action. Very hard to control. If I'm excited at all, angry, nervous, delighted, enticed, I burn hot. Hot enough to burn anyone who gets close. Hmm. You must be pent up. I try not to think about it. I still think about it constantly, but, you know, I try. One of these days, I'll sort the whole infernal affair out, get myself cooled off, start making up for lost time. But... Not today. Hmm. Anyways, uh, I want you in the party. Come on, we're heading out. Party. What should I do? Take Shadowheart's place. And then, where's Will? Will? Where art thou, Will? Gail? Will! There he is. And you'll take Gale's spot. Well, then. I'm up for the challenge. You've just got to make a little space. Let's make... Okay. Oh! Okay. So, hey, we've got this soul coin, right? Thing is, I think I can use it. My engine can, anyway. Zariel used to top me up every now and again when she wanted me to go after an especially wicked target. Huh. Got a coin slot in your heart, or what? Sort of. Next time we find ourselves toe-to-toe -to -toe with something we want to squash, drop a coin in. See what happens. Intriguing. Or I'm not sure. You know what? A soul coin belongs to whoever souls it is. Most, but the vast, vast oh. majority of soul coins are put to use by devils. Better for us to use them in the fight against evil. Next time we're in a mad battle, you'll see. If something wicked can be put to proper use, that's a good thing. Yep. It can be. So that's neat. Well, we'll have to take a look about that then. All right. So where was that pig? It's over here, right? Yeah, let's go check out this. Let's have a look. Strange. It looks healthy, but it's stone dead. Bloodless pig meat. The pig's dead, my friend. Staring at it won't bring it back. Come on. We'll never fix these brain worms if we stop and gawk at every piece of carrion we find. Oh, we don't have guidance right now. Ah, we crit it. Nice, good. Okay. The ball 
all seems to be fresh. Only a few hours dead. Examining the corpse, you see two small puncture wounds in its neck. And is it dead enough? These marks seem strange. Do you recognize them? <laughs> nice. I. It's been drained of blood with wounds in its neck. It's been killed by a vampire. That I has. Didn't want to say because I didn't want to worry you. They are ferocious creatures. But don't worry. I'll keep watch tonight. We won't have to worry about nocturnal visitors. Now, please, let's go. Mm-hmm. Yes. Oh, good. The village is on fire. Uh, dead drow raider? Hello? He of the unsleeping eyes, grant me the might to carry this burden. Grant me the faith to face darkness without fear. Uh, my condolences to you. He should never have been here in the first place. I'm the one that talked him into joining the fist. The fist? What happened the massacre. here? Drow and goblins slaughtered the lot. Oh, good. Please, just leave me be. Okay. I hear shouting. Someone needs help. Drowcraft armor. No magic left though. Sun's too bright. Oh yeah, don't steal from the mercenaries, just Get in there. <laughs> we can do it. Put your backs into it. Push. This is fantastic. That's right. Three, two, one. Push. <laughs> nice. Just kick it down with your little gnome feet. Okay. I guess we're heading up. The heat coming off that door. Opening it could spell trouble. Well, this is one way to break it, right? Oh, come on. Counselor Floric. Um, I'm afraid proper thanks must wait. Okay. Where are we going? Pretend the beam is too heavy to... No. Fine leverage. Fine leverage. Oh, we crit it. Nice. Good. Otherwise we'd have to... I wish we could use, like, Carlac there. I think... That's it! If 
Thank you. Now, how the hell do we get out of here? Come on, follow me. Okay, so let's... Um, why are we in like in turn-based mode? Oh. Damn, it's good to be alive. Oh, because you guys need to get out that away. Got it. And where are you, Will? Um, why can you not blast that? <laughs> All right. Hmm. Nothing really helpful here, Will. Okay. Uh, probably take some damage from fire and stuff. All right, we'll dash you. Mind if I get closer? While I'm at it, because you're almost out then. Will. Can get out. What path lies before me? What now? Step lightly. At last. Your boldness is a blessing. I'm in your debt. Counselor, are you all right? It takes more than mere fire to break me, Eva. Now listen close, Fist. Duty calls. Drow have taken Grand Duke Alder Ravenguard westward, if my eyes and ears can be believed. Huh. Gauntlet, report to the manor and send for reinforcements. We must find the Duke. On your command, Counselor. The rest of you, count the dead. Take word of their sacrifice to this city. And you, I must ask again for your aid. Please, rescue Raven All right. from his drow captors. The Council will reward you for your effort. May I trust you'll see it through? Uh, why interest this to me? I have others. Man, who's Duke Ravenguard? Um, Ravenguard's a champion to the people of Baldur's Gate. Oh, no fealty to your sum uppers. <laughs> uh, yeah. A champion indeed. He's the invisible force holding Baldur's Gate together. Kind of wish we had me there, but. The city faces collapse. In fact, I fear that may have been the intention of those who abducted him. Got it. Uh, why entrust mists to me? You have others. Arrives, it might be too late. You've the heart of a dragon and the will of a hero. Tell me I can count on you. Yeah, sure. Thank you. And should your courage falter, remember the Duke's generosity. Got it. Go. You should pick up the drow trail with ease. I yeah. will seek reinforcements and join you when I can. Fist? to work. Oh, oh. The sparky points, the jolt shooter, the spell sparkler. To choose one. Uh, when the wielder deals damage using this weapon, they gain two lightning charges. 
So that's just it between it all. Trident or Spell Sparkler is a quarterstaff. We'll probably go with that. Okay. I've got a long road ahead. So let's exit. Um Who? Miri. No. Gods, no, no, no. You should have stayed. You should have been with me. How would you I get separated? We had a fight. If I just kept my mouth shut about that bloody dowry, she'd still she'd still be here. Um what was this photo down? Sister's wedding. I made a stupid joke about keeping it. We argued about it for hours. Then she took the dowry and left. She said I'd never see her again. She was right. Uh, this isn't on you. There's no way you could have I'm known. I'm sorry, Mary. I'm so sorry. Please, just go. I need a moment with her. Okay. Oh, that's a uh, book we can take. Is there anything we can grab over here? So the soap bars are what you want to get for when um, okay, lady. Uh, so when you're like dirty and stuff, um, you want to use soap bars and things to. Um, clean yourself up and actually we can toggle group mode everyone should make their way down here all right we'll talk to will now he sees the burning embers of king's rest then Floric's face as she tells you of Raven God's abduction. Hells. Older Raven God's been taken. Yes, Drow set fire to the inn and stole away with the Duke. You must know the man, judging by the concern in your voice. I know him better than most. Hmm. He's my father. Right. I know I haven't said. Our relation was no matter of pride. Um, choice is clear. We should rescue Thank him. You. That means a lot. But I wonder, what makes a Duke of Baldur's Gate so interesting to the drow? Even the houses of Men's Oberanzen would have little use for my father. No, this is no drow plot. These absolute nutters, these true souls are behind his abduction. His yeah. absence alone will sow chaos in the city. If they were to infect him, he could lead Baldur's Gate to ruin. That's not good. The more reason to find him. The Absolute has seized not just my father, but the future of the Sword Coast. Shouldn't keep secrets like this from me, Will. And you're right. My story is one of two men. The Blade of Frontiers. A man hunting the fiends who prey on the weak and claw at the coast. And Will Ravenguard. A memory of a memory. A man who belongs to the past. Hmm. I wanted you to know the blade, not the shadow he left behind. Okay. I'm all for it. Is there anything else we can talk about here? Not yeah, sure. So enchanting as you'd think. The poor tears, the cold wells. They were the blue bloods hosting the fancy balls and 
drinking from gold goblets. Father's the son of a blacksmith, born with barely a coin in the coffers. He made a name for himself among the flaming fists, brave as Balderan, stubborn as a deep rope, daring, outspoken, but hardly posh. I spent more time dueling with father than I did rubbing elbows with lords. Not to say I didn't develop a taste for good wine and the talent for courtly dance. And now you're the Blade of Frontiers, quite a change. Yes, and no. Father taught me the four pillars of power. Courage, insight, strategy, justice. He reckoned I'd follow in his footsteps. First as a fist marshal, then as a duke. Vanquish evil, maintain order, save the world. But a duke makes bedfellows with more monsters than he slays. Father called it diplomacy. I called it hypocrisy. Mm. In the frontiers, there is no posture, Pretty well, yeah. no diplomacy. I slay monsters. I don't consort with them. Even if I might look like one. All right. Okay, so we've got a few things here. I want to come back up here. And can I pickpocket that girl? <laughs> if I hide here... Whoops. Okay. All right. Can't do it. I really wanted to. Because I'm feeling we're going to need whatever she has on her for this dowry. All right, Carlac, you come in here and explore because I'm pretty sure this stuff doesn't really affect you. Okay, well, maybe that does. Well, let's put it this way. You have a lot more health than everybody else. Maybe we can do this without... Recruitment poster, eh? Okay, so this isn't anything major or crazy. Picture of beer, carafe of wine. Lots of alcohol. You're not supposed to land in the fire. fine. She'll be fine. Ow. You're supposed to take that, not break it all. <laughs> Blinded. Can we get upstairs still? It's not all like super destructed. I'm actually surprised those books are still there. We'll grab that, add it to wares. Okay. You're fine, Carlac. Okay, now that we're in here, maybe we can find some, some anythings. I don't have to stand in the fire, 
You know that, right? Hey. Mirror. Okay. Anything else over here of note? Bed linens, household prayers. It's on fire now. It's fine. Case file 846. Baldur's Gate versus Flynn's Silver. Okay. We'll pick that up. Um, well, you can bash down a door quite easy. No cause for alarm. People of the Sword Coast, there's no cause for alarm. Okay. Nothing too crazy there either. Nothing in these vases. Nope. Um, open crates. Got some stuff in them, I guess. Jake's Encyclopedia of Eels. Inside or inside? Or downstairs? Okay. Man, I, I really wish there was a easy way to see like what what those things are. I don't know what she actually saw or where it was. Oh, there's a burrow hole. Okay. Okay, that's what she saw. Got it. Got it. Well, lots of food. So that's not so bad. Very um, boring stuff to find, basically. That was weird. Didn't mean to do that. But you know that'll work. Charred corpses. Ooh, a letter. Well, we'll get that in a minute. Okay. Well. We can break that, I guess. There we go. Okay. Well, we've gone through all this stuff. Anything in here? Only looks like some crates. Okay, and it doesn't really look like we, I guess we can go over here. Okay. A sweet key. Okay. Uh, well, I guess everyone's going to be running through the fire here shortly. Come on. Ah. 
Come on. It's only a little fire. Looking ahead. Okay, there's a dead ox up here. I don't know what I thought the ox would have in it. There's a frightened ox in here. Gods are watching me. Monsters everywhere. Killed. Oh. Persuasion, look at me. I'm not a monster. Oh, good crit. No, you're not. They were small like you, but uglier. Huh? I was ready to run you through. My mistake, friend. It's all right. What happened here? Attack. Monsters. Little ones and taller ones. They took the shiny one. He killed many. The shiny one? Did you kill the ones in here? It was screaming, waving around its metal. I made him stop screaming. Uh -huh. Do you know the dead ox uh -huh. outside? He was the biggest. No, I'm the biggest. <laughs> That's fantastic. He was the biggest. Now I am the biggest. Okay. It's just a stable. Uh, looks like we'll be able to get into here. Isn't this the uh, Zentarum people? A man crouching between the shelves, just as he spots you. Um, little serpent, long shadow. Oh, Helm's orbs! I thought you were flaming fist. Well, down you go then. They'll be on us soon. So if you're looking to trade, you'd best be quick. Entrance is hidden behind the wardrobe. Here's the key. Okay. Thank you. This is all fire wine stuff. I accidentally break that. Oh boy, start going through all this stuff. There's going to be lots of useless stuff, I'm going to imagine. I can't imagine there'd be a lot of good stuff in here. Probably don't need to worry about actually taking the bottles. Um, I don't want to go do this part right now though, so we'll like going down there and taking them the chest, etc. Or I guess um, we don't have to take them the chest right now. Or w wait, no, we don't give them the chest at all. That's right. Encumbered. All right. Okay, sort by type. Add to wares to Carlac. Add to wares. to Carlac. Where's Carlac? Um, also, where's Carlac? Carlac. Oh yeah, I want to send this to Astarian. Um, 
all this rotten food. You can also go to Carlac. It looks like we leveled up there too. For some reason I didn't see that. Okay, well let's level up because this is actually going to be very good for us. We have a class feature. Wow, we got a lot of stuff. All right, class feature, level two spell slot, cantrip spell, new feat. So cantrip, let's grab maybe friends. Yeah. Spell, level two spell, eh? Blindness could be good. Calm emotions, cloud of daggers, crown of madness. I could do crown of madness. Heat metal is also nice. Hold person, invisibility. Knock. Phantasmal Force. Deal damage to a creature each turn. Interesting. Shatter is very nice. Silence. You know what? Let's take Shatter because I don't really have a damage spell. And this is the part where we want to go, all right, we now um, can get a feat. Feats are great. Lucky. Lucky is a phenomenal feat. You can use a luck point to gain advantage on your next ability check, or you can use a luck point to gain an um, attack, ability check, or saving throw, or make an enemy reroll their attack. So that's nice. Uh, we can just get like a 2 plus 1s. So I could get charisma to 18 and dex to 16, which is phenomenal. Um, proficiency bonus is also doubled for deception and performance checks. I mean, that is also very nice, and we would get our charisma up. Alert. Plus five bonus to initiative, can't be surprised. Athlete, we're not gonna ever get on us. Same thing with, with that. We could be a crossbow expert. Defensive duelist, finesse weapons. Use reaction, add your defense, your proficiency bonus to armor class. Not really what we're looking for. That's not bad, but also not what we're looking for. Constitution up. And we go to full hit points every time we short rest. That is nice. Elemental adept. Yeah, that doesn't help us much. Lightly armored. Um, performer. Musical instrument proficiency. Okay, so we already have that. Um, so that's not very useful for us. We get two rituals of our choice if we do that. I mean, skilled, gain proficiency in three skills. That's something that we'll want to get eventually. Gain advantage on saving throws to maintain concentration is very nice. Um, but honestly, I'm looking at actor to get that proficiency bonus doubled for deception and performance checks and charisma gets increased meaning that like vicious mockery and stuff like that i'll get a plus one so we're gonna take that we'll take actor astarian doesn't get a whole lot here just uh some health and then a feat as well um what would be good for you? Crossbow expert would be good for you. Or dual wielder. Because that could mean like um, two hand crossbows. 
Lucky is also nice. Uh, mobile, increase your movement speed. That's really good for him to get around. Sharpshooter as well from high ground rules. That's actually kind of neat. Um, you could take a minus five, but deal 10 extra damage, and that's extremely good. I think we'll take Sharpshooter on you. Because you're pretty well only ever doing that, and then if we turn it on, um, yeah, you don't get the, you get a minus five to your attack roll, but you generally have advantage. So that's just a bunch of extra damage that could be. Carlac, also really basic, just get a feat. Um, and honestly, we might just go strength and con up. You gain Charger, Weapon Attack, Charger Shove. Yeah, so you can just charge in attack is pretty good. Um, we don't really care about like shields and stuff with you. Tavern Brawler. When you make an unarmored attack, oh, unarmed attack, no, no, we're not doing that. Weapon Master. Actually, is not that great. Um, pull arm master could be right. Glaive, halberd, quarterstaff, or spear. We're not using any of those. That's unfortunate. Savage attacker when melee. Yeah, that just increases damage. Don't always roll your um, damage rolls twice. Great Weapon Master as well is also good when you land a critical hit or kill a target with a melee attack. Make another one. Um, so again, this is kind of like the Sniper Sharpshooter one. Take a minus 5 to your roll, but deal 10 extra damage. So that, or... Um, Savage Attacker, or increase these two stats by one. If, see, if we do this, which is kind of what I really want to do, you get a plus one to all your attack rolls and damage rolls because we have that extra plus one, and you get an extra, you know, little bit of health. So I'm going to do that. I know it's boring. But the next time we go, we'll probably get um, Savage Attacker and then Great Weapon Master. The plus one. In, in a game of rolling a d20 and adding stuff, you, you, it's really good. Um, so Will gets Cantrips, Bone Chill, Friends, Mage Hand, Minor Illusion. Let's just get Poison Spray or something. Cloud of Daggers, Crown of Madness. Actually, I was thinking about that one. Yeah. There we go. And very similar to you, you need Charisma up to deal with your spells. And Dex would be good because you use a Rapier. A lot of these care less about for you as well. A spell Sniper, though, could be good because you use Eldritch Blast. So if you get a 19 or 20 on an Eldritch Blast, you get a crit. That's nice. And then we can get you, like, Ray of Frost as well. Okay, that sounds good. All right, so coming back to all this stuff, I still want to get it all. Here we go.
Holy. The joys of doing this like this. <laughs> Just another crate. Yep. It sure is. Well, we're getting lots of stuff. Alright. So that's how we get down. Entrance through the wardrobe. I guess we just, um... We go in there and then there might be a wardrobe down there, I guess. Not too worried about it at this moment in time. We'll come back. I don't think we really need, um, oh, oh, I thought we were going behind, um, Will and Car, well, we could keep Carlac, I guess, still. Surprised this hay hasn't gone up in flames yet. Hmm. Well, hello. Very nice. Aha. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Can't complain about that. We found the dowry. And the chest is in my way. Very well. Was that... Find the missing shipment. Trap man. We'll probably want it back. Yeah. Okay. bunch of stuff over here which we'll take a look at Something nice oh good amounts of money so that's kind of nice. And then that's it for over here. Okay. Can't steal anything from that guy because... Okay, here. Can we... Okay. <laughs> we'll just do that really quick. Seems like a good moment to talk. <laughs> I found this chest. I think it's yours. I know this doesn't change anything, but it helps. Thank you. You're welcome. I need some time alone with her to say goodbye. All right. All right. Well, the only last thing that we kind of want to do here is go into here. So I guess we'll do that. Um, we're going to go back into and change our um, people out though. And we're probably going to do a long rest. Okay, so we're here. No one needs to talk. Let's get rid of Will and replace him with Gale. How can I help? Um oh, 
Nothing would give me greater pleasure. Back in the f And let's get rid of Um wait actually Carlac, are you holding the chest? that to Lysel and give that to me yeah then a starian actually thinking about it yeah oh, yeah we can just send money to camp right yeah there we go. Let's okay. Move. Speak. Oh, Lysel. The party's full. You'll need to make room. Well chosen. Okay, because then you can level up, and then I'd like some Shadow Heart instead of a Starion. I think. I wasn't expecting it, but I'm glad to have some company. It seems like you have ample company already. You wonder. Okay. All right. So let's level everybody up. Wizard level four. <laughs> Two spells, new feet. Um. Shocking grasp might actually be good for you. You seem to be in the midst of things sometimes. Um, Scorching Ray is very nice. So is Melf's Acid Arrow. You need some damage spells is what I'm kind of looking at. And then like a Misty Step. Melf's Acid Arrow. I think that sounds good. And you, sir, I think we also want to go... Oh, we could do... So, Warcaster. That would give us <laughs> that. Um, concentration. You don't have a lot of concentration spells right now, so I don't think we need to worry about that. But the Spell Sniper is extremely nice. So, we're going to do that and get you we get you eldritch blast intriguing uh let's go bone chill sounds good to me lizel just gets um stronger here and she's gonna go the boring route as well in terms of abilities um and then next time she's gonna basically follow the same thing savage attacker um she could be a shield master depending if we want her to have um a shield or shield and sword or something along those lines Shadowheart just gets a cantrip on top of the other stuff. Okay. Gain advantage on intimidation and performance checks. Herself or anybody? Well, let's go with that. You, however, are going to want... Uh, wait, no. Not that one. Warcaster. Advantage on concentration spells, because as a cleric you have a lot of concentration spells. Bless, Bane, all, the, all that type of stuff. Alright. Then we're going to end the day. Nobody wants to talk. Good. Let's end, go to bed. And we'll full rest. Well, flitting between dreams and nightmares. Maybe you wake 
up because you know something is wrong. Or maybe you just get lucky. Shit. Hmm. No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. I... I wasn't going to hurt you. I... I just needed... Well... Blood. There, in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire. A slave yep. to sanguine hunger. I mean, it's not that... Um... Surprising. I can't believe... I didn't see it. We even found the boar you snacked on. It's not what you think. I'm not some monster. I feed on animals. Boars, deer, kobolds, whatever I can get. <laughs> I'm well, one just of those too is... slow right now. <laughs> not an animal. <laughs> too weak. If I just had a little blood, I could think clearer. Fight better. Please. A so strange sensation courses through you, and your companion's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. Okay. Why didn't you tell me? At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. No. I needed you to trust me. And you can trust me. Okay. I do, I believe you. Thank you. Do you think you could trust me just a little further? Do we let him I need a taste. I swear. have some blood? Alright, but go too far and I'll drive a stake through your chest. Ah, of course. I shall be gentle as a babe. Interesting. Let's make ourselves comfortable, shall we? And my cat is attacking my foot. Also kind of like a vampire. It's like a thinking it's ice into your neck, a quick sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness. Your breath catches, your pulse quickens. Okay. That's enough. What the oh, heck? Can of no. That. That is not yours that to. Get. Amazing. Oh. It's clear. I feel strong. I feel happy. Okay. I'm looking forward to seeing you fight. Take long. So many people need killing. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me. You're invigorating, but I need something more filling. This is a gift, you know. I won't forget it. All right. He watches he stalks towards the forest, stronger, more confident, ready to hunt. Interesting. Okay. Anyone that we can talk to? Astarian? <laughs> What's up for discussion? Good morning. How do you feel? Fine little woozy. Just be glad I'm not a true vampire. A bite from them and you might wake up as a vampire spawn. Like my good self. All of a vampire's hunger, but few of their power. Is that how you can stand in the sun? Because you're not a true vampire? Oh no. I should be cinders in this light. I hadn't seen the sun for 200 years before we crashed here. Someone, or something, wants me alive. They've changed the rules. Standing in the sun, wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities now. Hmm. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. What's causing this? The Mind Flayer Parasite? That's my theory, but who knows? 
I'm just glad you're being sensible about these uh, revelations. I was worried people might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Although there's still time. A vampire? Well, that explains the pallor. Given our group's nature, I don't see much harm. We're each monsters in the making, after all. <laughs> for his sake, he best not develop an appetite for Gith Yankee. I trust him. He won't hurt us. I'm here in the spirit of openness and honesty to work together as a team. Maybe we could get him to wear a bell, dissuade any nighttime prowling. <laughs> there now. We're all friends again. Shall we go? There's a long day ahead of us. Yep, yeah, it sure is. And we are bloodless. Minus one, two attack rolls, saving throws, and most ability checks. Lovely. Let's talk to Scratch. Hope you're keeping well, friend. We are. All right. Well, with that, I wasn't expecting um, that part. Um, we'll probably call the episode here. Next time, we'll head into the Zentarum base with this crew of people. I think that sounds pretty good. Camp inventories. Okay, so we can actually move stuff around from in here. I mean, we might as well give that to Carlac. Yeah. Um, just I in general. I wanted to see about that. This one here, the Jolt Shooter. Yeah. So we'll do that. We can give a light crossbow plus one to like Gale, I guess. Yeah, okay. Well, we'll do that for now. Um, I don't think she has anything else, right? No. Okay, so we'll call it here. So thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.